What it do everybody, Merry Holidays. My name is Ross Panetta, chef and owner of Fire Kitchen. Today we are here to test out four celebrity cookie recipes to see which one is the jolliest. We have Taylor Swift, Mariah Carey, Melania Trump, and Jessica Alba. I measured out all the ingredients as each recipe stated. And I got three cookie enthusiasts to come test them out to see which one is their favorite. So which celebrity has the best holiday cookie recipe? I'm about to make it rain, dear. Let's get it. So first up we have Taylor Swift's cookie recipe. You're gonna cream together butter, sugar, egg, vanilla, and oil until it's all nice and mixed. Make sure that move. We're gonna throw in our baking soda, salt, and her little secret, chai tea. Once the batter has come together, we're gonna slowly add our flour in increments until the batter is nice and smooth. Now that your cookie dough is formed, we're gonna put it in the refrigerator for about an hour or in the freezer for up to 15 minutes. Once the dough is nice and set, we're gonna divide it, throw some flour on the board, flour on our rolling pin so it doesn't stick, and we're gonna roll it out to about a quarter inch thickness. Take your favorite cookie cutter, make sure to keep it festive, not like I did, and cut out some shapes. On a lined baking tray, we're gonna place the cookies about two inches apart and bake at 350 degrees until nice and golden brown. We're gonna to put together the eggnog icing in a bowl, cinnamon, nutmeg, and a little bit of eggnog. A lot of powdered sugar. The icing was looking a little bit thick here, so I added a little bit more eggnog to reach the consistency that I wanted. Once the cookies come out of the oven, we're gonna ice the top of the cookies with the eggnog icing and just a dash of cinnamon on top for a little bit of flavor. And there you have it, Taylor Swift's chai tea eggnog cookie. What is this? This is a beautiful color. I love a little brown on brown uh, cookie. <laughs> Looks like a gingerbread cookie maybe of sorts. Some cinnamon for sure. A little weight to it, that's always good. Mmm. That's nice. It's a crispy cookie. Personally, I'm more of a, I like a little bit of softness in a cookie, but, but this isn't too hard. It tastes kind of like those like biscotti cookies a little bit, but elevated. I feel like I'm more into like the chewy cookies, but I really like the cinnamon. Whoever made this one, I guess really enjoys the holidays and really knows how to spice things up. I could see myself eating like a hundred of these and forgetting that I was eating anything, so probably not give me more of them. Next up we have Mariah Carey's cookie recipe. In a bowl, we're gonna cream together butter and sugar until it's light and fluffy. Once that's done, we're gonna add an egg, milk, lemon zest, vanilla, and we're gonna mix that up until it's nice and smooth. We're gonna add baking soda, salt, and once again, add flour in increments until you reach a nice consistency. Once the dough is finished, we're gonna bring it together and wrap it up in plastic and refrigerate it for about 15 minutes to a half hour. Now that we're ready to roll out, flour the board and flour rolling pin so it doesn't stick. We're gonna roll this dough out to about an eighth of an inch thickness. Since Mariah Carey is the queen of Christmas, I cut these out in Christmas tree shapes. Once again, on a lined baking sheet, spread them out about two inches apart and bake until golden brown. Once the cookies come out the oven, Ice to your heart's desire. Do not at me. I'm having fun, kind of. Once you're done icing the cookies, throw a little red and green sprinkles on that thing and plate it up. Mariah Carey's holiday sugar cookie recipe. This is cute. Got some fun sprinkles. Very sparsely uh, sprinkled though. If I'm making cookies, I just kind of go ham on the sprinkles. I want it to be everywhere. <laughs> mm. Whenever you drool, that's a good sign. Okay. It reminds me of like those animal crackers, kind of. Yeah, this one's definitely a bit drier than I would like. I mean, yeah, this is like your regular sugar cookie, just a little bland. If it's a sugar cookie, where's the sugar? With something this dry, you either need to make it a little softer or you need to add like a lot more frosting. I'll still finish the cookie though, so. Step it up, celebs. And next up, we have Melania Trump's sugar cookie recipe. In a bowl, we're gonna combine flour and baking soda, set that aside. In another bowl, we're gonna combine butter, sugar, egg yolk, egg white, and cream that together until it's nice and smooth. Once that comes to a nice consistency, we're gonna add in our sour cream, vanilla, salt. 
We're gonna mix that up until it's fully incorporated. Once again, working in an increments, we're gonna slowly add our flour until the dough forms. Once the dough is formed, we're gonna wrap it up and throw it in the fridge for about 15 minutes to a half hour. Once again, flour your board, flour your rolling pin so it doesn't stick, and we're gonna roll this out to about a quarter inch thickness. She used stars, and I used planes to cut out my cookies because, you know, she's about to jet out of there. And on a lined cookie tray, place it about two inches apart and bake it at 350 degrees. Once again, ice to your heart's desire. I suck at icing things, as you can see. And there you have it, Melania Trump's sugar cookie recipe. Is this a plane? Quite possibly an angel? <laughs> it's like a dove or an airplane, not super sure. Oh. This kind of tastes like the crust on a pie. But some people enjoy that type of taste. I don't. Maybe the icing's a little bit more flavorful. Nothing really special to me. That one just crumbled apart. It was nice. It wasn't super sweet, but it's easy to chew through these. It's kind of like a little cracker. So like this one was pretty good. And next up we have America's favorite crush, Jessica Alba. In a bowl, we're gonna combine together coconut oil, powdered sugar, vanilla, almond milk, and mix that up until a batter has formed. We're gonna throw in some cornstarch and mix that up until it gets a little bit thicker. And lastly, work in in increments once again, throw in your flour and mix until a very loose sandy dough is formed. If the dough is looking a little too dry, you can add more milk and bring it to the consistency that you want it to be. We're gonna wrap it up in some plastic and throw it in the fridge and let it harden for about an hour or two. Once your dough is ready to be rolled out, go ahead and flour your surface, flour your rolling pin, and we're gonna roll it out to about a quarter inch thickness. Once again, choose whatever shape you want. I chose an angel because you already know she looks like one. And on a lime baking tray, spread it out about two inches apart. We're gonna bake these at 375 degrees or until golden brown. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen, Jessica Alba's vegan sugar cookie recipe. Enjoy. This one looks like someone died. <laughs> it looks very dry. I mean, I guess cookies are supposed to be dry, but this is an ashy cookie. Mm. Mm. Why is there a crunch? Oh God. <laughs> what was that? I didn't know something could be impossible to chew through, but also chewy. Is this like a health cookie? I'm really confused. This like hurts my teeth, but like biting it. It's like picking up a brick and starting to, to bite it. In spite of the difficulty of chewing through this, like if you don't want too much sugar, but you still want a little treat, the flavor from this could, could do you for that. This isn't it. I'm sorry. Do I get a free dentist? After this. So which celebrity has the best holiday recipe? Let's find out. Out of these four celebrity holiday cookie recipes, my favorite has to be number one because it was bold. It wasn't scared to throw in those extra flavors. The texture was good. The sweetness level was high. Tay Tay, I guess she just got a new fan. My favorite would actually have to be number three, I think. I actually really liked how thin and crunchy it was. I thought it was like a nice, Kind of subtle treat. Who, whose was that? Melania Trump. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe Melania is a better baker than I would have anticipated. I never pictured Melania Trump baking, but surprised there wasn't like gold leaf on it. I think I'm gonna have to go with number one. Definitely the one I enjoyed the most. I liked the cinnamon. The icing on top was nice. Okay, I respect that. I think uh, I think she did a good job. Good job, Taylor. Taylor Swift takes today's celebrity holiday cookie challenge. Let us know which holiday cookie was your favorite. Leave a comment below.